So I keep hearing this song on the radio, right? I keep hearing it over and over and over, and I had no idea who it was from. So I looked it up, I went on the radio station, and I was searching for, like, a song that says something about scared of the dark, scared of dentists, scared of... Ah, oh, what is it? And I, and I eventually found it, luckily for me. It was called Riptide by Vance Joy. I was like, this song is sweet. It is an awesome song. And so I was like, you know what? I have to teach it on the ukulele. So guys, welcome. Today I'm going to show you how to play Riptide by Vance Joy on the ukulele. Let's go! So what's cool about this song is that there's basically only three chords that we have to learn and the strum pattern is not bad. So it should be pretty fun to learn on your uke so you can take it around and play it for your friends or family or whoever. Now before we start guys, I should let you guys know that for the correct key, we want to put a capo on the first fret just like that. But I know some of you guys don't have capos, so no worries. Uh, you can just play it without the capo. It sounds fine. It's not a big deal. For this tutorial though, I'm going to show you with the capo on the first fret. So the first chord is our B flat minor chord. We're going to put a bar on the first fret just like that, and we're going to put our third finger on the fourth string third fret so just like that guys um, that is our B flat minor chord take a look and it sounds like this the next chord is our A flat now I'm gonna cheat a little bit on the A flat I'm gonna show you how to properly play it and I'm gonna show you what I do so to play this chord the correct way you're gonna put your first finger on the third string third fret your second finger on the first string third fret and your third finger on the 4th string, 2nd fret, right there, and then finally your 4th finger on the 4th string, 5th fret, just like that. That's what that looks like. What I do instead is, instead of having this pinky on here, because this pinky is kind of weird, I take it off and I just mute the 4th string with my thumb by just kind of lightly placing it on there, right there. So by lightly placing it there, you can't really hear it when you play it, it doesn't make a sound. And then basically you just have this chord formation over here, and that thumb right there muting the fourth string and it sounds like this. So again, here's what it looks like. Um, make sure you get that one down with the thumb muting that string right there. Uh, once you have that, that's probably the hardest one, we can move on to our G sharp chord, our final chord. That one's pretty easy. We're going to put a bar on the first fret right here and we're going to put either a third finger or a pinky on the first string fourth fret right there. That's what that looks like. So together, it sounds like this. B flat minor. C sharp, G sharp. And that's basically the uh, entire progression for the entire song. Once you have those down, you're ready to move on to the only other thing there really is in this song, and that is the strum progression. Hey. So the strum pattern is actually really cool. I like it a lot. It's really fun to play. It sounds like this. Down, down, up, down, up. Down, down, up, down, up. So you can try it with me. Down, down, up, down, up. Down, down, up, down, up. Okay? Once you have that, we can start speeding it up so it sounds like down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, up. Just like that. So get that down, nail it, down, down, up, down, up. And once you have it, we can put it all together to play Riptide. So here's what it sounds like with the three chords and that strum pad. So as you can see, uh, we play it once on the first chord down, down, up, down, up, once on the second chord, down, down, up, down, up, and twice on the third chord, down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up. Once you have that down, the strum pattern, the chords, that's all you need for the entire song. It's super duper easy. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to hear me play it, you want to hear it actually working with the ukulele, click right here to check out my tutorial. If you're on mobile, uh, you can click my channel and then go to the tutorial because annotations don't work. But otherwise, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you can now impress your friends by playing Riptide on the uke. And as always, don't forget to be awesome.